Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how to edit photos on Xiaomi 14T and 14T Pro. In order to do this we need to go to the gallery. And of course over here we can choose a photo that we want to edit. So let's say I'm gonna choose this one over here. And let's press this icon over here with this pen at the bottom of the screen. And there we go, we are now editing the photo. If your photo has a watermark then you can easily enable and disable the watermark over here. You can use the automatic effect, so then the device will decide by itself the, so let's say, optimal effects that you can apply in order to edit the photo to make it look better. We have cropping, we have filters, so let's say we're going to choose actually a filter, let's say this one. Uh, we have different categories, of course, of these filters, so uh, make sure to go through some of them if you're looking for something specific. Oh, and of course, if you choose a... Um, let's choose this one for example. If you choose a filter, we can actually tap on it again in order to adjust the intensity of this filter, so keep that in mind. We also have some adjustments like the exposure, we have the brightness, we have the contrast, we have the saturation, uh, vibrance and so on and so forth. So as you can see, warmth, tint, highlights and so on. Lots of lots of different options, of course I'm not gonna go through them. And through all of them, uh, we're gonna move on. We can actually doodle on our image, we can draw lines, we can uh, draw straight lines, we can draw rectangles or squares and so on and so forth. We have text and then we move on. Wait, that's not all. We also have mosaic, so we can apply some effects apparently. But to be honest, I don't see... Oh, right, we have to draw. Um, so yeah, we can add some um, things like these hearts over here, because why not? Uh, or even those things. Uh, yeah, so lots of lots of different effects. So let's move on. We also have create, so we can once again create a watermark. Um, unfortunately, in some cases, you cannot really add the watermark. In this case, it says that only images taken by Xiaomi products co-engineered with Leica are supported, so I guess this one isn't. Uh, we have the magic eraser where we can erase things from the photo. We have bokeh um, where we can... Oh, it's actually downloading, I think. Yeah, so it needed to download. Sometimes some effects might need to be downloaded in order to, uh, to be able to use them. And yeah, uh, keep that in mind. So I guess this one looks kind of weird. I don't know if it actually does something. We have sky, so I guess we can improve the quality of the sky or the colors maybe of the sky. In this case, I don't have the sky on the photo, so I can't really uh, do that. But let's actually tap in order to find out if actually it is possible to do something with it. Yeah, there we go. As you can see, we are taken out. The background is removed and the sky is added instead. So, and we also have some beautify options as well, like we can improve the skin of our character on the picture to make it smooth, as you can see by the forehead, it actually makes a difference, which is pretty crazy. Uh, we have skin, we have complexion, we have enhancements, and so on and so forth. So, as you can see, lots of lots of lots of different options, I guess you get the idea uh, at this point. So now, uh, the last thing before you try to save the photo is, of course, the quality over here at the top. Either here or more in the middle, you will have the option to adjust the quality of the photo. Of course, most likely you want to have the best quality and 100% of the size. Once you are done with your photo, you can press save in the top right corner. And there we go. We have our edited photo, which should be at the top. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.